What's going on guys, Aussie here and welcome back to a brand new video. So today we have got our first foot birthday player to review and it is going to be Mikatarian, a player that's now got 5 star skill moves with a 5 star weak foot. He's got medium medium work rates and he is a 5 foot 10 player as well. The stats on the card look incredible. 90 pace with 91 dribbling, 89 shooting, 88 passing with even 80 physicals as well. Like we're talking about a Mikatarian that has a really nice amount of strength to his game. Now the chem style I've decided to go for is the Hawk chem style. I feel like it's perfect, let's say, for this card because you're giving him that extra pace. So if he sees spaces in behind and he runs into it, hopefully with that 96 acceleration and 95 sprint speed, the defenders won't be able to catch up to him. Now the shooting ability getting upgraded as well is super nice because you are giving this guy crazy, crazy shooting stats. And he's got a five-star weak foot while also having the finesse shot trait as well. We are looking at a Mikatarian with 96 long shot and 99 shot power with a five-star weak foot and a finesse shot trait you best believe we're going to be trying we're going to be going for a few finesse shots today and hopefully they're going to be flying into the back of the net now his passing ability short passing immaculate long passing 81 isn't anything special but you guys know what i say what usually happens if a player's vision is really, really high and their long passing is not so much is it tends to balance out. So personally, I feel like that long passing is going to feel better than 81 because of his vision being 93. Dribbling with a T, haven't touched it with a chem style and it looks really good, especially with five star skill moves. I think there's no question about it. Mikatarin is going to feel good on the ball. And if you're looking at his physicals, 95 stamina is super nice. 80 strength with 88 aggression is also really, really nice to work with. Now, the links, club-wise, it isn't too bad. Like, Spinazzola, you get a strong link there. You get uh, a Banus, that's a strong link there as well. You also get uh, the new Tammy Abraham card that came out as an objective card today. That's a nice little link as well. So, yeah, the links are pretty good with the club, but nationality-wise, it isn't anything great, let's say, right? It's no French nationality, it ain't no Brazilian nationality, and it ain't no Portuguese nationality. So, yeah, the links with the nationality in this game aren't great. But the club is not too bad. What I've done, I've just gone for Brahim and uh, Rivaldo just to get him on full chemistry. Now the positions, two positions, striker and cam in a 4-1-2-1-2 narrow and a 4-4-2. So let's get into the games and let's see how good Mikatarian is going to be. Driven that straight through the gap. There you go. Just double tap that through the middle there. Scoop turn it. Go on, Mikatarian. Use your pace now. Just keep it going. We're going to try to go for a green timed with that five star weak foot. And I'm not sure who actually put in the block there, but it was a very good block. Give it over to Kante here. Just driven that into Mikatarian. Nice acceleration. Good ball roll. Good turn as well. Just shoot it across goal with that five star weak foot. And it's going to get slotted right into the corner. It was a really quick turn from him there. Give it to Vinny through that gap there. Mikatarian with that McGee spin cancel. Accelerate. Referee. Referee sort him out. He's probably going to leave as well now because he's going to get a red card. I knew it, man. I wanted to shoot that free kick as well. Driven that straight for it. Mikatarian. Come on, use that pace. Good acceleration. Really good acceleration. This is against Hakimi as well. He's brought out the... Wait. I don't want to talk about... It. No way. No way we should be getting that. No chance. He brought out the keeper perfectly. The keeper didn't go down at all. I thought he was going to as well. We just got lucky. There's no way of saying it. Mikatarin's pace, though, was really good against Akimi there. Mikatarin just waiting for that ball, not really making a run in behind there. Vinny, go on. Because I can accelerate, use him as a dummy. You know what? Let's see if this is actually going to go in. I want to try it, you know. It's a five-star weak foot. He's got the finesse shot trait. We can try that kind of stuff just to see if it's going to fly in. Chip that over to him. Touch. Wait for it. Nice turn. Give it over to Vinny. And then Mikatarin going to continue that run as well. No shot. He brought out the keeper there. I was not expecting him to bring out the keeper like that. Like, that is literally perfect for my opponent, though. I'm just going to go for one, two. Get him in behind and just use that pace. Keep it going. Keep it going. Ball roll. Let's go for it. Finesse shot. Green time with the right foot as well. And he gets slotted right, slotted right into the corner, man. This guy's paused there as well. Is he going to leave? He is going to leave. And you guys clearly can see right there. I am currently playing Mikatarian in a striker position. And he's not disappointing. Give it into Mikatarian. Accelerate through the gap. Oh my god. If the AI didn't actually get involved there, we are through on goal. That acceleration to get through that space was really, really good. But yeah, once again, if the AI didn't get involved, we're in. 
Oh my god, his player just got put straight onto the ground. Let's see if we can actually score here. I feel bad if we do end up scoring. And he pulls out the keeper perfectly. Everyone's like bringing out the keeper now. Mkhitaryan, what are you going to do? Nice movement. Really nice movement. Because he realizes where the open space is. And he goes straight for it. And we've got past that guy. No, I tried to shot cancel past him so I can get a good opportunity. Once again, though, really good movement for Mkhitaryan to realize where the open space is. Kind of looking for an option in the middle. Vinny has gave it to me there. Bull roll. Give it up now. Good turn. I've screwed it. Bull roll. Oh my god. No, referee. The Mkhitaryan rather has to drop onto the ground there and we get a penalty or we have to get past. There's no way we get into that kind of animation. I need a passing option. I see a drill and pass straight into him. Good turn. Nice little fake shot as well. Trust in that five-star weak foot to get placed into the corner. The five-star weak foot is so nice to have inside the box because you know you can turn either side. It's not like you're forcing it just the one side. Scoop him. Nice. We'll roll that. Good dribbling. Give it back to Brahim so I can double tap that through the middle. Should we chip it? He keeps bringing out that keeper, man, and he is definitely going to get chipped out one point. Give that down to Mikatarian because he's in behind here. We'll roll. Against Luke Shaw, he's put him onto the ground. No, I tried to last to go through the legs, man. Can I get that through the middle? I can. Give that up to Mkhitaryan now. Good dummy. Really good dummy. Look at that turn. Ball rolled that. Migiri spin cancel. Nah, he actually read me there. Can I still give it to him? I can. Double ball roll. Get around that corner. Over to Rivaldo, and we have ourselves a goal. It was definitely lucky to get the ball back, but we'll take it. Mkhitaryan's movement, I must admit, is really nice in that strike position. Like, he doesn't really stay central a lot of the times. And he does definitely like to go out wide. But he gives me so many passing options. I'm going to see if I can just pass it across here. Vinny on the ball. Yeah, Vinny's never going to miss an opportunity like that. But you do notice how he goes out to like the sides a lot. And gives me that passing option. I don't mind that one bit. Mkhitaryan again, man. Making that run. Trying to be very aggressive. I could have crossed that. I can still cross that, to be fair. Go on. Go for a bicycle kick. No way. Vinny. Vinny, Vinny, Vinny. You trying to steal the show? Like this is Mika, this is a Mikatarian review, not not a uh, not a Vinny review. My God, if that went in, see if I can just go for like a finesse shot at a very stupid angle. There you go. It's not even too bad of an angle. It is a. F oh my God, the Hayes animation all over the place. But oh, what a shot! I'm gonna see if he can continue that run, and it is a very good pass as well. Is he gonna support me here? He does. Fake shot, La Coqueta in between them. Nah, Varan man. Mkhitaryan, what are you going to do? He's going to go to the side. He's going to make a run back up. Him against Varan. Shot towards an near post. Oh my. De Gea. Are you all right today? Like, it looks like he was about to save it. It looks like he was about to get a hand towards it. But Mkhitaryan with the shot power just made it fly in. Keep it going. I'm actually going to send Vinny on a run. Come on. Go on, Vinny. Can you? No, it was a good pass. A very good pass. I like how I can go either side as well with Mkhitaryan and do those kind of passes. I don't have to worry about like a three-star weak foot or anything like that. I know he's got that five-star weak foot, so I can pass with his left perfectly. And I obviously can pass with his right perfectly. That's a good pass. A very good pass. Accelerate. Ball roll. Ball roll again. He's already coming towards me, so I have an opportunity to go for a finesse shot. It wasn't exactly the height I wanted for the finesse shot. I wanted it a bit more higher, but it was still a very good shot. One, two. Go on. Mkhitaryan versus Varane. Keep it going. I think Varane's going to catch up to him. Oh, he actually slowed down there. We have an opportunity to go for an amazing pass, and it was nearly an amazing assist. I need to run up. There you go, man. Mkhitaryan's actually found that space as well really nicely. Look at the left stick dribbling. Like, I really do want to show you guys the left stick dribbling as well. And not just, like, the skill moves. You can really tell he keeps that ball very close. He does those little tight touches as well, which is really nice. But he, is, he definitely isn't like a... Oh, my God. Imagine we actually get away with that. He definitely isn't a player that feels like a, a Lionel Messi with the left stick. Or even like a Neymar with the left stick. I definitely would say those two players... Left stick dribbling is 100% better, but it's still very, very good on Mkhitaryan. I'm going to see if I can play this pass. Go on, Mkhitaryan. Give it a go. His passing ability is top tier. Like, you can tell with the amount of curve that he puts behind the passes and where he actually lands as well, like ahead of the player, it's literally spot on. Let me see if I can get it driven into him here. Nice little shielding. Really good shielding. Oh, my. Give it a go. Go on. No. Can I score from that angle? Oh, okay, Verdi. All right. You see the strength, though? Against Varan, a player like Varan should never be getting held off like that. But with Mkhitaryan, Mkhitaryan's strength, he's apparently able to do it. I'm going to go for another switch. 
I see him making that run in behind and look how perfect of a pass it is. Can I get a passing option here? Oh, there is one here. Straight for the middle. The goalkeeper was kind of positioned a little bit off, let's say, but it's perfectly fine. It was an amazing pass from Mikatarian, and we get the sweaty goal at the end. So it is time to review and we ended up playing five games with Mikatarian. We actually scored seven goals and we also did come out with two assists as well. He was doing everything on that pitch. He was assisting. He was scoring long shots. He was shooting inside the box with the left and right foot and it was flying into the back of the net. Then there was other occasions where it, he allowed us to go for like quick counterattacks because of the passes he was producing, aka the through balls. Insane. Just straight up insane with what this guy offers you in game, man. I thought maybe the pace wouldn't be enough to get in behind someone like Varane, let's say. Well, his acceleration to get in behind really, really isn't a joke. His shooting ability, you guys saw it left foot, right foot. It didn't matter, man. It was getting placed into the corner. The passing ability, I was kind of worried, let's say, for the long passing right at the start because it being 81 is not great to look at but i believe in that vision obviously being 93 and it getting balanced out and you guys clearly clearly saw that he's passing is not 81 no shot it's more into like the 87s i would say even maybe 88 his passing was top top tier the dribbling ability the skill moves came off really nicely very very nice with the skill moves the left stick dribbling i would definitely say it isn't up there with the best left stick dribbling i have seen in this game but it's still very very good to work with and the physicals loved his strength i must admit loved it like he, he was a player that was actually holding off a player like Varane, which was something I definitely didn't expect, but he did it and we actually ended up scoring a goal from it. So yeah, strength as well also did surprise me. Now this card is going for around 230k. It's amazing pricing. L listen, all right, the fact that EA actually made this card under 300k is outstanding. I kind of understand why they did it because like the links he gets isn't anything outrageous you know we're not talking about like a french play here that plays for like psg let's say if he was french and played for psg this card would easily go for like 600k as an sbc man it would be a joke but yeah him obviously uh playing for roma and all it's 230k i think that's absolutely outstanding pricing if you've got a Serie A team you really can't go wrong is he the best cam in the Serie A? is he better than uh brahim diaz it pretty much is the main question Yes, I would say so because of the five-star skill moves he gives to you. Now, where would he go in the attackers tier list? With what he offers you, the dribbling, the skill moves, the five-star weak foot, the finesse shot, the pace, the passing with the physicals as well. It's hard to say that this guy is not an S-tier card, man. So yeah, S-tier for foot birthday, Mikatarian. I hope you guys did enjoy the video, though. If you did, make sure to leave a like, make sure to leave a comment. But for now, peace.